Yo, what's up, y'all? A Money Blends here, blessing y'all up with another banger. So in this tutorial, we're gonna do a mid taper, Edgar style, but we're gonna go in with our trimmers. You know, setting the guideline about half a circle. Now we're gonna go with our shavers and start shaving and balling out the bottom, leaving stubbles about half an inch, so you won't make a harsh guideline. Now I'm going in with my foreguard. I'm making sure I'm cleaning the rest of the bulk that's hanging and I'm only leaving the clean bulk with the foreguard. Now I'm gonna go with my rebels and I'm going to get set in my second guy line with my lever open, going in about half an inch. For the next step to this taper, I'm going in with my number one lever open, going in about another guideline on top, about half an inch. Now I'm going in with my two guard. As you guys can see, I'm using most of my corners. They bulk most of the bulk that he has and most of the dark spots. To all my clients who struggle to do the neck lineup, here's a little tip. Go in with a 4 or 6 guard depending on how much bulk he has. As you can see how I'm going, just follow the same directions. Doing the neck lineup should be 10 times easier. Now we're going to go in with our lever closed and start hitting the bottom guideline. Now we're gonna go in with our half guard, cleaning up the area where we went with our one. And we're basically gonna go halfway and go up and close, basically playing with all our levers. The next guideline that I'm gonna set in is our one and a half. And we're gonna basically go in about another half an inch on top. guard basically cleaning up the rest of the bowl because as you guys can see how i go in and set up my guideline i'm in a scoop out motion all right now we're gonna go in with our trimmers and we're gonna start doing the neck lineup Now we're gonna go with our three lever open and closing it, um, getting rid of most of the dark spots that we see. Now I'm going in back with the one and a half and basically playing with my levers so I can go back with my one lever open and start flicking it out. Now I'm going in with my half guard, playing with the guards, basically getting rid of all the dark spots that the one guard didn't get. Now we're going to go ahead and line up the C cup right now. Now we're going to go ahead and begin the other side. Remember, same steps you do to one side will be repeated to the other side. After we just went with our four guard, we're just going to go ahead with a trimmer, set in that half circle. We're going to go in with a shaver again, leave the stubbles about half an inch to an inch. Now we're gonna go and set in our guideline with our lever open and don't be scared to dig in with your guidelines because whatever you create with that guideline is going to be erased but just to remember just to close the lever. Now we're gonna go about half an inch on top of that guideline with our number one guard. Now I'm gonna go ahead with my one and a half guard and set in another half inch guideline on top of that. Now 
now we're gonna go ahead and erase all those guidelines that we just created starting with the lever open then we're gonna go ahead with our half guard and with a one and a half closed with the lever open to fade that out and then we're gonna clean up the rest of the bulk with a two clean it that out with a one and a half and then the three clean that out with a two and then with a four clean that out with a three Now we're going to go ahead and begin to line up the C-cup on the other side. Now we're going to go ahead and start the bulking so we could do the neck lineup. So for the finishing touches on this, I'm going to go ahead with our one and a half, then going back with our one and clean the rest of the bulk with the two. Now to start off the back taper, we're gonna go ahead with our number one guard, lever open, basically cleaning up the bulk so you can see where you set your guidelines. So to begin, we're gonna go ahead with a trimmer and start the guideline where the end of the earlobe goes. Now we're gonna go ahead with our lever open, send in our first guideline for the back taper with our lever open, setting it about half an inch. Next step we're gonna to do is number one guard, lever open, half an inch. Next we're gonna go with our baby little shavers and we're gonna go ahead and leave some stubbles about half an inch. Now we're gonna go in with our gammas and start removing the lever open guideline by removing it with the lever closed. And we're gonna remove that number one guard line with our half guard. Now we're gonna go with our three guard. As you guys can see, it cleaned up most of the area. It started cleaning up most of the hair. So we can get a clear view on the canvas on what we're gonna cut. Now we're gonna go in with our two guard lever open. Now we're gonna go in with our one and a half, basically blending in that two in with that one and a half. We haven't fully finished the bag taper yet, but we're gonna go ahead and begin the 3D design and we're gonna go ahead and start doing the Z shape design. If you guys ain't know about it, yeah, I'm going to have a giveaway real soon. So make sure to stay tuned about that. The way how it's going to work is that the winner is going to be decided in one of my YouTube video comments. And the most likes in that comment will get the Clipper giveaway. Make sure to stay tuned whenever that giveaway does go out. Make sure to tell all your friends the most likes in that comment will get that giveaway. crazy how a year ago I couldn't even do a simple design but now I can do any design they show me just to give y'all a little bit of motivation and shit but if y'all want to see more work like this go ahead and check out my Instagram page at 8 money blends it's probably posting some tapers fades designs and all that now we're gonna go in with our one guard and start getting those dark spots that the one and a half clothes didn't get now I'm going in with three, cleaning up the rest of the area. So I'm going with our two. Now that we have finished the sides and back, we're gonna go ahead and start trimming the top. We're gonna go ahead and start applying some water.
Next step, I'm going to be doing is some clip over comb. If you don't know what clip over comb, just look at what I'm doing and that's what it is. Now we're gonna go ahead and begin to start cleaning up the eyebrows, the C cup, and then we're gonna go ahead and also do the lineup. All right, you guys, so right now we're going to go ahead and start working on the design. I'm going to go over the outline and go over it with the straight blade. Alright you guys, we're going to go ahead and start applying the paint and as you guys can see, I have my business card that I'm going to use as my uh, edge up. So right now we're combing the hair so everything can lay down flat and um, we're gonna go ahead and begin the hairline and then we're gonna go ahead and then apply a styling product at the end. Now we're going to apply this clay product to texture the hair and then after we texture the hair we're going to go ahead and line it up one more time. And just like that we're done with that mid taper. We did the eyebrows, we did the mustache, we did the design, we trimmed the top. Hope you guys enjoy this haircut tutorial. Hopefully this video helped you guys out and comment down below what kind of haircuts do you guys want to see next. Comment down below if I snap. And if you're in the Chicago area trying to get a haircut, you already know where to hit me at, at A Money Blends on IG or book on Booksy to book an appointment with me. That's the after. If you guys did the step-by-step -step tutorial, this is the mid taper y'all would get and end up with. Clean and sharp and crispy. Look at this shit. Let me know what you guys think. Comment down below. Did the type of tutorial you guys wanted and Edgar type shit. Add a little paint to the sides and shit. Check it out. Let me know what you guys think. Check out the back. Oh, I did a little 3D design. But shit, let me know what type of tutorials y'all want next. And shit, this is the mid tape tutorial. Hope y'all fuck with that video. And just get it, we're gonna have more videos soon. Peace, we out.